Here's a quick update on the sense cap that we mentioned yesterday. Yes, things are moving fast and you can have your hotspot by the end of July. Uh, let me just start with a lot of people asked about the Discord. So you're going to type in discord.com because that's where the news is. That's where you can be updated. That's where you can do everything. So if you don't have an account, you just create an account. It's free. Then you come here to explore public servers and then type in Helium. You'll find the official Helium community. And then what you're going to do is scroll down to the sense cap. So now here you can ask any questions to the vendor, whether the frequency is coming to your, uh, is, is supporting supported in your country, what kind of frequency is supporting your country, when are they going to have it? Any questions you have, please, guys, this is your place to ask technical questions or anything else about this device. So let's look at the pinned messages. Uh, these are just today, just two hours ago. So when I told you guys this has a big portfolio, when I told you yesterday that things would go very fast with SenseCap, I was right. Look, it's, fa it's founded in 2008. Seed, which is the creator of the SenseCap M1, is among the world's top three open source hardware providers located in Shenzhen. So this is the company. Now let's see what are the updates. Where is the product page where you order your... Uh, uh, hotspot. Since uh, since Cap M1 will be sold through Seed Partners, our partners working on the page. Estimated launch date is the end of June or early July. Stay tuned in Discord. So you want to be one of the first hundred or two hundred to buy this. Uh, is there a wait list? No, there's no wait list. Uh, when is it available? When is the shipping time for the first batch? Both versions will be shipped before mid of July. Then we will update the lead time for the following batches. So, uh, what is the price? It's not finalized yet, but like I told you yesterday, I would assume it's in around the three uh, end of 300, mid of 400, uh, because they made it just a practical machine um, or hotspot to do what it should do. Nothing else. It doesn't have to look fancy. It doesn't have to have all these lights or whatever. Um, they have a new Twitter handle. This is it. You join and see and get updates. Question about the products. Since Cap M1, is it a full miner or light spot, a hot spot? The product we are going to launch is called Sense Cap M1 LoRaWAN Indoor Gateway. It is a full miner which supports uh, supports POC. So you're getting everything. Uh, this device is not for outdoor use. They're still working on the accessories because of the request, but as of now, does not support outdoor. Also, the versions, that the frequency versions, they only have US and EU, unfortunately, for you guys uh, that live uh, that don't live there. So, uh, will there be light spots? Yes, in the agenda, will there be other frequencies? It's available only for US and Europe. Other frequencies are not supported yet. Uh, is the current existing, this is important guys, is the current existing SenseCap LoRaWAN gateway a helium hotspot? When you Google SenseCap, you will find there are other gateways also under the name of SenseCap. Please be aware that not all the SenseCap branded gateways are helium hotspots. SenseCap M1 LoRaWAN indoor gateway is the only one that supports helium network. All right, so guys, first of all, I guarantee you there will be new websites under the sense cap coming up with from scammers so you need to if you decide to buy you need to buy it through the official channels don't be scammed that's one thing uh, second thing if you want to outdoor use this is not for you if the frequency is not supported you can ask in the discord when is it going to be supported can I buy someone and then you can get me uh, the, my you know frequency later on when is it coming out all your questions in the Discord. Uh, none of these uh, devices you can buy are the existing. So the existing SenseCap devices are for data uh, data transfer. The SenseCap M1 LoRaWAN is a helium full helium hotspot. So here's the 
like the or the general overview of this so you need to make sure that the frequency is supported you need to make sure that uh, you're not gonna use it for outdoor you need to make sure that you buy it through the official channels all right guys and I, I don't need to say this more than once because lots of people are buying bobcat miners in the US with European frequency and the same thing in Europe so uh, make sure you do due diligence also there's this website's called the things network if you click on enterprise then frequency plans by country if you don't know what's the frequency in your country you can check with them out here so that's the research if you guys don't know anything about helium hotspots if you don't know about uh, IOTs so the evolution of helium is this is a good video for you this is all in my channel so you can access them if you don't know which uh, if your location is good for a hotspot you need to watch this video it's, it's a bit long but if you do the steps you would know if your location or how much uh, lucrative your location is or should you buy one or two or three or whatever so this is not a financial advice this is just for educational purposes and I'm just sharing with you the knowledge that I'm receiving so uh, this is the networks also the SenseCap M1 comes with a 1.2 DPI antenna it's a very very low uh, power, uh, low power so you need to buy the 5 DPI uh, as an accessory from the SenseCap or seeds so these are my tips on how to move on I would stay on the discord because once they announce it and they open the door for purchase I think their servers will be suffering so a lot of people are interested so and and trust me guys the people that actually people are buying through eBay Bobcat miners and Nebras for five and ten and twenty thousand dollars because they know the more they wait they're losing money so this is the only chance so far that you can get your miner by the end of July I don't know if I showed it to you but um, just to confirm I would be sold through seed okay we start to accept orders pre-orders um, for the for the first batch both versions will be shipped before mid of July so I think they will accept the payments maybe end of June or beginning of July so you guys need to be careful and you can see here in the discord there's a lot of traffic 222 messages since 2 2 p.m. that's like two hours ago and this is not nobody knows about yet so uh, at least it's not like as famous as the rest so what else do I need to cover uh, you need to do your due diligence you need to do um, to make sure that your that your frequency uh, is there this is not for outdoor use and most importantly you buy the DPI uh, antenna the five at least if you need more you need to do your own research which are in the videos that I have in my uh, channel um, I think this is it if there are new updates I'll definitely put them in this channel so I I invite you to hit the bell and the subscribe and like the video if you find some value as of now I will um, be definitely updating you with anything regarding the helium or MXC networks. Alright, we'll see you in the next video.